I just wanted to talk to you because you are the person more than anyone else in Florida who can advance First Amendment values and principles of open government. Uh, I remember that you handled uh, media relations for Hillsborough County State Attorney's Office. Uh, and I wondered if you'd just outline for me a little bit about your philosophy and your feeling about uh, what your duties are to open government. Well, as the Attorney General, we, have, we handle public records requests. Um, we handle open government, and I'm very proud to have brought Pat Gleason back to the office. And I'm in quite a, a unique position because as a prosecutor for nearly two decades, for over a decade, I handled all the public records requests for the state attorney's office in Hillsborough County. So I firmly believe the public has a right to know. Um, we have to have transparency in our government. Um, we have to uphold our constitution. So that's always been very important to me. One of the first things I did when I was elected was contact Pat Gleason um, and say, you know, I, we had been talking actually before the election and said, I really um, want you to, to work with me. And um, she was very excited about that because over the years I had relied on her. Of course, she's written the book on public records. I also have a great communications department. That was very important to me. Um, Jen Meal and Jen Davis do an incredible job. Um, I believe when, when the public request documents that we should get them to them as fast as possible in the most efficient manner as possible because again, that's who we work for. Well, you, you have to look at everything on a case-by-case -case basis and we save our emails, of course, um, and if they're requested we print them. Now the problem with an investigative agency is you often have to redact some confidential information if it includes bank records or social security numbers. So that can be time consuming. Um, so you have to go through each one of those. But again, I have a great communications department. Um, we try to respond as quickly as we can because I know that's very important. And transparency in government is what it's all about because we work for the public. Well, in Florida, under Chapter 119, we have very broad public records laws, actually some of the broadest in the country, in my opinion. So pretty much everything is a public record, unless it's an exception under 119, such as home addresses of law enforcement, um, social security numbers, bank account numbers, and if it's a pending criminal investigation, no one wants to jeopardize a, a criminal investigation, but what you do in that situation is initially withhold the information if it's a pending investigation explain why that's to me the most important thing is explain why you can't give something at that time and then provide it as soon as you can well again I would have to know the exact details you have to look at the volume involved um, exactly what was requested the details of what was requested again we try to respond as quickly as possible the public has a right to know it's all about transparency in government, but some requests are voluminous, so it depends on the request, but we do our best to almost drop everything and comply with public records requests as soon as possible here in, in my office, and that's what I can speak for.